When Helping Hurts, How to Alleviate Poverty Without Hurting the Poor, and Yourself, by Steve Corbett is a thought-provoking and insightful book that challenges traditional approaches to addressing poverty. The author presents a compelling argument that many well-intentioned efforts to help the poor actually perpetuate the cycle of poverty and create dependency. Corbett proposes a different approach that emphasizes empowerment and community development. One of the key ideas in the book is that poverty is not just a lack of material resources but also a result of broken relationships and a sense of marginalization. Corbett argues that simply providing handouts or engaging in short-term relief efforts does not address the underlying issues that contribute to poverty. Instead, he suggests that effective poverty alleviation requires a holistic approach that takes into account the social, economic, and spiritual dimensions of people's lives. The author highlights the importance of recognizing the dignity and capacity of individuals living in poverty. Rather than treating them as passive recipients of aid, Corbett emphasizes the need to involve them in the decision-making process and to build upon their existing skills and strengths. This participatory approach helps to restore a sense of agency and self-worth, enabling individuals to become active contributors to their own development. Corbett also critiques the common practice of short-term mission trips and relief efforts that can unintentionally create dependency and undermine local economies. He argues that such interventions often prioritize the needs and desires of the volunteers over the long-term well-being of the communities they aim to serve. Instead, he advocates for long-term, sustainable solutions that prioritize the building of local capacity and leadership. Throughout the book, Corbett emphasizes the importance of fostering healthy relationships and partnerships between those who have resources and those living in poverty. He encourages readers to shift their focus from doing for to being with the poor, emphasizing the value of listening, understanding, and walking alongside individuals and communities in their journey towards development. Corbett also challenges the prevalent Western mindset that equates poverty solely with material lack. He argues that poverty is a multidimensional issue that includes spiritual and relational brokenness. As such, he suggests that poverty alleviation efforts should address not only the material needs but also the spiritual and social aspects of individuals and communities. One of the strengths of Corbett's book is his use of real-life examples and case studies to illustrate his points. These stories help to humanize the issue of poverty and demonstrate the potential for transformation when the right approach is taken. Corbett's writing style is accessible and engaging, making complex concepts easy to understand and apply. Overall, When Helping Hurts is a thought-provoking book that challenges readers to reconsider their approach to poverty alleviation. Corbett's emphasis on empowerment, community development, and long-term sustainability offers a valuable framework for those seeking to make a positive impact in the lives of the poor. By recognizing the dignity and capacity of individuals, fostering healthy relationships, and addressing the multidimensional nature of poverty, we can truly make a difference without inadvertently causing harm.